friends. So today is such a proud and exciting day for a mama. Y'all my baby girl. We are going shopping for his prom. His first prom, my baby graduates this year. I'm so excited. So we are actually going to a tuxedo place because he wants a tuxedo. And um, <laughs> so he wants a tuxedo. So we're gonna go see if we can um, look at what this tuxedo shop has. And um, I'm super excited. So I'm gonna open up and take you guys in with us and let you in a little bit on mom life with a teenager. So let's go. anything oh look look at the jackets here oh that teal looks nice no uh, look I, I thought that would have been your flavor oh that little shiny you about to perform <laughs> you a temptation in that oh that looks nice that color oh, you gonna drive me nuts kiddo Oh, you trying to go Fresh Prince of Bel Air style? <laughs> He likes this blue y'all i think the blue is cute too i think i like the blue more than the red yeah the red is nice too the red and black but i think i like the blue so he would want to do a black shirt Are you excited kiddo <laughs> We're celebrating two things, his 80th birthday and also obviously Father's Day. So I'm excited because I haven't seen family in a very long time. And this is one of, well, this is my favorite uncle in the whole wide world, AKA he's like my dad because he helped raise me. Um, so I'm excited to see him and everybody. So dinner should be good. We're trying this restaurant uh, and I think this is a bed -Stuy. It's called Imani and they're supposed to do like, um, I want to say Caribbean comfort food, so that's where I'm headed. So I just want something really quickly, which is this little black dress. Um, I'll try to get an outfit thing, but you know how family gets. Like, listen, I'm not a blogger, you are. That's exactly what they'll say to me. <laughs> so, anyway, yep, so I'll chat with you guys later. Hey Pop. So guys, this is my uncle that I rave about all the time. Pop, can you say hi to the camera? Can you say hi to my people? Just wave hi. I'm recording you. <laughs> so this is my uncle. This is the man that raised me. It's my uncle slash my pop. <laughs> now you see where I get the flyness from? Like my uncle is fly, y'all. Like I can't even tell y'all. He had more clothes than my aunt. <laughs> Can I tell you what you wanted to do to me? Yeah, you told me. I appreciate it. Alright, these are my cousins. This is my bro. <laughs> Y'all know Kali. No, this is your first time. I never put you on a vlog before. Wait, let me stand up. Wait, I never put you on the vlog? No, I ain't never been on the Okay, okay. I'm gonna get on one today. So I'm gonna introduce you to some of my cousins. 
with they're really like my brothers. Like I really grew up with these people. So let me introduce y'all. <laughs> All right, so this is Jaquan. How you doing? He's one of my favorites. Yes. This is Kali. He's one of my favorites. And then this is my cousin slash sister. This is Eve. Oh, Are you waving? Is somebody watching? No, no, no. I'm gonna record it and edit it later. You like is this live? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. No. Oh, stop. All of the girls that watched it, you bet you better stop. They gonna get you. They gonna be like, you are way too small to be saying that. She's so fine. You know she's like low key a bodybuilder though. Yeah, see, look at that. I'm telling my family, we all look young. Because no one believes I'm in my 40s. I'm 40. No one believes that. She's 40. Yes. Yes. No, no. She's a year ahead of Day Day. Oh, right, right, right. Because I'm older than Day Day. Day will be 40 July 3rd. Yeah, no one believes me when I tell them that. Nobody believes me when I tell them that. Yeah, but the, my family looks young, and I'm not lying. 44. I know. Look. 44? Ooh, how do you? Oh. Yeah, yeah. See, you see the grays? I see the grays. I see the grays. All right, and this is my cousin. Are you ready? I think so. This is my cousin Zakia. Hey, y'all. She just graduated from college. What college you graduated from? Delaware State University. She's a hornet. <laughs> and this is my cousin Lamont. Lamont James asked me again to tell you the same. <laughs> <laughs> that's some like that that's some Virginia <laughs> folks. <laughs> I'm I'm I'm, I'm uh, 35 reverse. <laughs> reverse them. I'm 35. You still look young tenderoni. <laughs> Medea. 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 And this is Lamont's Auntie aunt. Ramona. Hi, Auntie Ramona. Hi, how you doing? She it came on down for the festivities. Yeah. She's a local yokel. Yeah, she's yeah. a Brooklynite. We have a good time. Yeah, so we're having dinner at Imani's. So we're having dinner at Imani's it's behind me. So it's a Caribbean restaurant. I think I, told, I just said this when I was in the Uber. But yeah, so we're gonna, we just finished ordering. So I'm gonna eat and chat. They cleared it up. He cleared it up. He cleared. What he say, Kai? Rest in peace to the oxtails. Yeah, pop saw it up. It's still going. That was a hook on that. That was some damage on that. That's for sure. That's the oxtail. Hey, when I get oxtail, I said I want that shit close to the booty. Booty, booty, booty. Come to eat the food. I come to eat the food. I'm not gonna put that in the food when you put it before me. Yes. Look, look, especially if it's good. Rest in peace. Yes, rest in peace. Well, them lamb chops look good too. Rest in peace. You had them already? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't really like the player. I'm gonna dump that in. Happy birthday, Pop. Yeah, thank you. Yes, we love you, Pop. Thank you. Yeah. And I hope y'all be right. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> well, ain't no need of her laughing because she's coming up to be 82. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, you a Scorpio yeah. on this side here? Sag. Oh, okay. Alright, so y'all want to know where the style come from between my mama, my uncle. Come on, Pop, show them the Take outfit. This is, here. this is old school stuff here. Take your this ain't no hip hop. Here. This is old school. That's right. Old school stuff. Custom made. That's right. Oh, let's Taylor get the made. shoes. Let's get the shoes. No, that's Woo! right. Tell them they. Tell them they, that's Pop. Right.
week and what you guys just saw was basically pretty much everything I've been up to so far between like the middle of May to now the middle of June. I truly truly cannot believe we are mid-June already. I just got through filming uh, a reel for Lane Bryant. I'm working with them again and we're doing some cacique stuff so they got some new bras and they're having a sale. Uh, so that's why I'm all dolled up today. So I feel like I haven't spoken to you guys since I've been back from Puerto Rico. And uh, besides my videos, you know, the hauls and stuff that I did, but I haven't had a sit down chat with you. So let me just say, Puerto Rico was the bomb. I enjoyed myself. The people, I mean, just how beautiful it is in puerto rico how good the food was i mean the food was uh, i feel like that's all we did i feel like we we ate <laughs> we did a little bit of sightseeing we shopped and we drank i mean it was truly beautiful and i truly love the people there everyone was super kind helpful even the uber drivers were very helpful we went to la placita uh, we stayed in old san juan but i have a vlog on all of this so you guys should definitely check out my puerto rico vlog i did go with one of my closest friends i've known her since college and that's many moons ago <laughs> um and i know some of you who did see the vlog you guys were like <laughs> she looked like she was sick of me with the camera in her face i promise you she was not <laughs> well maybe a day or two she was but i had already prepped her and told her sis you know i have to get some content for youtube for social media so i always with any of my friends anytime i want to film i always ask them do they want to be filmed are they in the mood and there's plenty of times they were like yeah i don't want to be filmed <laughs> and so you don't see them <laughs> but she totally was fine with it but nonetheless we really had a good time um again check out the vlog and you'll see now i did we did do like a little bit of sightseeing and a little bit of shopping we did not go to any we didn't go to the luxury mall we went to the regular mall and i didn't want to go to the luxury mall because i didn't need anything you know <laughs> luxury i didn't need another designer bag or shoes so i'll show you what i did pick up i mean nothing really exciting that i picked up except for these two things so i want to show you i did pick up this handmade this is a cured clay sculpture i thought this was so beautiful and i wanted it so i could put put it on here which is i call this a bookcase but it's described as an edge <laughs> anyway i thought this was just so beautiful uh and i wanted it and so i'm so glad that i got it so i thought this was cute and again this is handmade cured clay i also got these i thought these were so cute and fun and yes sometimes in the house i'm like shake your bomb bomb shake your bomb bomb shake your bomb bomb i'm puerto rico oh, no. <laughs> so i did get this and i also got a little um i also got love love one for his keychain a nice little small one and it's so cute it has a puerto rican flag on it so that's what i picked up these two for you know souvenirs and i'm gonna put it up here somewhere i'm actually gonna be redoing this whole thing um and getting some more sculptures and knickknacks is what my mama called the knickknacks to put on here i also got some coffee from puerto rico and i'm so mad that i only got one i was not sure how this tasted and so when i was in the airport on my way home uh at the kiosk they had this whole wall of different uh coffee brands and i was just like oh i have to you know try one of the brands because at the restaurants i did have coffee and it was so good all the coffee was nice and smooth and, and full bodied so i was like let me just try this one because this one was kind of higher up on the shelf and it was a little more pricier than the other so i said oh this must be good <laughs> y'all this is so good and i went on their site so oh well maybe they have it here in new york and i just haven't seen it or maybe it's at one of those like specialty you know coffee bean stores or something but their website is under construction and i don't know where else i can get this so i mean if any of my puerto rican followers if i have any <laughs> who live in puerto rico and y'all want to send me some more of this like i'll pay for, i'll pay for it obviously but i need this this is listen this is done this is basically done this is all i have left and i've literally been saving it 
for a day for those days when I'm like oh I need good coffee so I'm hanging on <laughs> also what you'll see in the Puerto Rico vlog <clears throat> if you haven't seen it yet I did go into a rainbows because we where we stayed in old San Juan it was like a little shopping district there as well so when we walked to sites we were walking to sightsee and then we were going to breakfast we were going to the Chaco bar food ugh. So good. I had chocolate coffee, chocolate French toast. Y'all better check out the vlog. <laughs> anyway, went into Rainbows because it was right there. And I have not been to a Rainbows seriously in years. So when I went to Rainbows, the first thing I saw was this lime green jelly bag. And I was like, this is so cute. I can't leave it in there. And I love that it has the straps for you to wear crossbody. It does fit on me crossbody comfortably. Um, it's like it just made it. I'm at the cusp of under my boob. <laughs> uh, and it zips up. And it can hold a lot of things. So I thought this was really cool and different. And it also comes in other colors. I got the lime green one. My friend got a, a nice pretty cobalt blue one. Very excited about wearing this this summer. And then also when we went to the mall... Um, we kind of just like really looked around and I happened to go into Banana Republic and I found a super pretty trench coat. So I don't need another trench coat but I wanted this one because it was a really nice bright yellow and I don't have a yellow trench, trench coat. And it's actually called a opera coat. So it's so pretty. Again, the color is gorgeous. It belts at the waist. It does have pockets and it's an oversized fit. So typically... I would have needed this in a true plus size. Right now, Banana Republic goes up to an extra, extra large and also up to a um, size 20. However, I was able to get the extra large in this and it fit perfect. And I'm super excited to wear it. And then also, I, when I came back from Puerto Rico, I did have a few PR packages. So I did get two packages from Sol Janeiro and then also from The Revolution. Oh, that was my um, my french fries in the air fryer. That's the beep you heard. <laughs> so I did get this as a gift from Sol Janeiro. It's their new body sprays. And their sprays smell so stinking good. Uh, so they sent me four of them in this cute little um, floral arrangement. Guys, this robe keeps peeking open. <laughs> so they sent me Tropical Nights. Now this one is creamy tonka bean and vanilla absolute. And then they also sent me, what is this one? This one is sea and soul. This is a juicy citrus. <laughs> this is a juicy citrus and ocean musk. They also sent me tan lines. And this is, a, this is the scent is solar tuberose. And it also has cocoa in it. And this one I actually already have. This one is pistachio and salted caramel. It's called Brazilian Crush. Every last one of these smells amazing. But this one, this sea and soul right here. Mm, this for the evening, like maybe after you get out the shower. And you know, you just want to still smell sweet and a little spicy. You know, whether you have bay over or you're just in the house by yourself. I love this scent. It is time to take these braids out. I have been trying to cover up my new growth and roots any way I can. So I just kind of like pent up my hair today. Um, I think I'm going to try a top knot with the braids. Just, you know, because the, the new growth is like, girl we coming out <laughs> i'm coming now all right so also from soul janeiro they sent me another package now this one is filled with their um with their different creams so well their moisturizer so they sent me four of their new moisturizers the first one is called this red one is called reveal radiance they have some good pr packaging <laughs> uh reveal radiance and this is the Balm Dia Brightening Cream. It's supposed to be infused with renewing fruit and vitamin C. And then we have the Boost Elasticity. And this is enriched with retinol. 
and also plant collagen. And then we have Deeply Hydrate. This one they said is their most moisturizing body cream. And this says it has plush moisture body blend. And then next up is Visibly Tighten. Visibly Tighten, which is basically their original bum bum cream. So I got that as, in my PR. And then I also got something from Revolution Hair Care London. And while I was on vacation, I saw people with this. And I definitely didn't expect to get this PR packet, so I'm actually glad that I did. And this is their new say this is their new hair care system. It says say goodbye to dry damaged hair with the Revolution Hair Care. Now this is supposed to, well what I heard on social media, rival Olaplex hair care system and i love olaplex olaplex that is the truth right there but now hair revolution so they have their own so they have a bond restore treatment and they have the number labeled as well so this is number three and then they have number four which is a bondplex shampoo and then they also have a bondplex conditioner which is number five and then they have a bond restore styling cream which is number six so when i take my braids out we can try this also i did pick up some stuff from the tabitha brown collection did you guys get anything let me know in the comment section below i feel like a lot of people have mixed reviews about her collection i feel like a lot of people on instagram loved it i feel like instagram was going hard for tabitha <laughs> tiktok people I felt like we're like, eh, it's not really my style. Some people were like, oh, it's for middle-aged women. And I was, I, it made me second guess myself because I thought this stuff was cute. <laughs> when she announced that she was coming out with her own collection, I was hyped and I was like, I want everything. I want it all. I thought they looked nice and bright and colorful. I thought the prints were really good, fun prints. You know, prints that most people aren't really afraid to wear, which is polka dots. Uh, floral print so I was super excited so to hear people on TikTok be like oh it was all right but Instagram people was going hard for, for Tabitha so I did pick up uh, I picked up like five pieces unfortunately four four of those pieces no I picked up six pieces but unfortunately four of those pieces were too small I mean were too big and one was too small so I only kept two items and I returned the others so from Tabitha's collection I did get the kimono I got the floral print kimono and I thought it was beautiful I love the color combination I love the style of the flowers on here and I bought it I sized up because I wanted to wear it as a dress and not a cover-up so I got this one in a 3x but I could have gotten a 2 but I got the 3x because I said you know what I want to rock this as a dress so I wanted it to fully cover it belts at the waist it's such a really pretty kimono in my opinion and then I also did pick up this floral printed maxi dress I feel like a lot of people like this one at the very least I thought this one was cute I did get it in the red and pink but that's the one that was too big so I got this one in a 2x and then the pink and red one I had got in a 3 um, so I'm, I kept this one because again I thought this would be a great summer dress just to throw on I just thought it was really pretty and I like the print so those are the two things that I got from Tabitha's collection that's everything I got from Puerto Rico again amazing <laughs> an amazing place and because I know somebody's gonna ask about this robe I actually got this robe uh, from Lane Bryant it was gifted to me for the reel I was doing uh, like I said I was on a bra reel and so I didn't want to like just be all you know with my bra all out so I wanted a um I wanted a robe with it and so I picked out this one it's super pretty it's like a, a tropical floral print it's so cute so i'll link it down below for you guys and for my lip i'm actually wearing a red lip from sephora this is their liquid this is from their lip liquid lipstick the actual sephora brand so it's a really nice bright red and it's matte 
so I went that down for you also all right guys so that is it for this vlog I hope that you enjoyed this vlog I let you guys in a little bit on my family thank you guys for all your support for watching the videos if you have missed videos definitely just check out the channel and you'll see if you missed any videos for sure check out the Puerto Rico vlog also check out my latest hauls I did a collective haul I also did uh, like an outfit slash type of haul video for my latest Amazon finds I'm definitely going to be doing some makeup videos I'm hoping to do one this week fingers crossed uh, it depends on how these edges and everything start looking because I feel like after a while gel and um, edge wax just just doesn't work anymore it's just like girl you need, you need a new do <laughs> so because you know makeup is like close up in your face and I don't want y'all to be trying to talk about me <laughs> and you guys got to meet my pop um in the video we took him out for his 80th birthday and it was also at, for Father's Day as well so pop is actually my uncle but I've been I've lived with him since I was about nine years old so he's a he's a dad to me and um, and I, I do know my real father so I met my real father at the age of 27 when I was pregnant with love love um, so I'm blessed to have two father figures in my life but pop is the one who basically raised me gave me all the knowledge and things I needed and he is very much part of the reason I am the woman I am today so I'm so glad that I was able to share that moment earlier in this vlog with you guys I hope that you enjoyed it because I normally don't share my business and I feel like sometimes some of you are always you know you ask about my private life and even other influencers are always like oh you don't ever share anything about your private life I'd be like nope because I don't like I just feel like everyone will be then have like an opinion on what you're doing and you know it's just like that's my business <laughs> but you know I like y'all you know I feel like we're cool so I just I didn't mind sharing that portion with you guys but anyway that is it for me make sure you guys hit that subscribe button down below along with the notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video also make sure you guys are following me over on Instagram at stylish curves also I am on TikTok and I post on TikTok pretty regularly now so follow stylish curves on TikTok and for more plus size style fashion and beauty make sure you check out the, the blog stylishcurves.com you can also shop any of my looks that I post on Instagram over on my like to know it and you can also shop my Instagram store I update that store every day with new items that I find or have tried links to all of this will be in the description box so please look under the video and click on the read more arrow and you'll see all of those links down in there everything I showed you just now will also be linked um, I feel like the tab of the stuff a lot of that is sold out but there are probably returns happening this week since it came out last week so you might find something something might come back back in stock so I'm still gonna link it anyway I'll definitely link the yellow coat the bag and um, also I'll link the products for uh, Sol Janeiro if anybody's interested so just check the description box girl <laughs> thank you guys so much I will see you in my next video bye